Today, I want to take a few minutes to speak with you directly and clearly about Ebola, what we're doing about it, and what you need to know. Because meeting a public health challenge like this isn't just a job for government. First, what we're seeing now is not an outbreak or an epidemic of Ebola in America. Second, Ebola is actually a difficult disease to catch. It's not transmitted through the air like the flu. You cannot get it from just riding on a plane or a bus. The only way that a person can contract the disease is by coming into direct contact with the bodily fluids of somebody who is already showing symptoms. Third, we know how to fight this disease. We know the protocols. And we know that when they're followed, they work. Finally, we can't just cut ourselves off from West Africa where this disease is raging. Our medical experts tell us that the best way to stop this disease is to stop it at its source before it spreads even wider and becomes even more difficult to contain. Trying to seal off an entire region of the world, if that were even possible, could actually make the situation worse. As I've said before, fighting this disease will take time. Before this is over, we may see more isolated cases here in America. But we know how to wage this fight. And if we take the steps that are necessary, if we're guided by the science, the facts, not fear, then I'm absolutely confident that we can prevent a serious outbreak here in the United States, and we can continue to lead the world in this urgent effort.